It's almost 2019 and the RGB game has stepped up once again. If you guys are not wearing RGB pajamas, you shouldn't be watching this video. But in this video, we're gonna be taking a look at the very hyped RGB RAM sticks from G-Skill. These are the Trident Z Royale, and I think they've been featured uh, in last year's CES. So, but I actually have the samples in front of me. We're gonna unbox them and take a closer look at them. So yeah, with that said, let's do this. So actually, I'm gonna flip these over real quick and see the backside. Uh, we can clearly see on here that we have a 32 gig kit. So we have uh, four eight gigabyte modules at 3200 megahertz. There's really no difference between these two other than the last two letters. There's RS on this one and then RG on this one, which I have no idea what those mean. We're gonna obviously open it up and figure it out. So let's actually start off with this one and take a look at the packaging from G-Skill. Now, I don't know if this is gonna be the actual retail packaging, but this is the sample uh, that they sent me to unbox in this video. Uh, here we go, here we go, let's do this. What? These are not your average RAM sticks, ladies and gentlemen. Take a look at this. Wow. So we have an all silver aesthetic. It actually has a mirrored finish. Damn. These are blinged up. This is crazy. That actually looks pretty dope, I'm not gonna lie. These are so freaking, they look so dope. Uh, let's put these aside real quick. Open up these other ones. Man, these are fingerprint magnets. Definitely gotta be careful when handling these. You do not wanna touch the surface at all. So I'm guessing the S on the back here stands for silver, and which makes sense. The G on the other one stands for gold. So let's go ahead and put these aside and open up the gold one. I think gold's gonna be my favorite, to be honest. Let's put this aside. Oh my God, <laughs> look at this. Yeah, I, th I think the gold is definitely my favorite. That is so crazy. I think my all time favorite RGB RAM sticks had to be the original uh, Trident Z from G Scale, but I feel like these these are gonna be my new favorite. Wow, look at that. Surprisingly, they're actually very light. I would think they would, uh, they would make this out of metal, but it kind of feels like plastic. So it doesn't really have, add any, uh, any weight to this. I'm even scared to put, it, to put this on the table. Like I don't even wanna scratch this thing. I'm just, gonna put it, I'm just gonna put it back in here, guys. I'll show you some sexy B-roll as I'm talking about it, obviously. Um, but yeah, there's pretty much not much else to it. They did send me this box as well, which I'm not really sure what's inside. Let's open this up and take a closer look at it. I would love to pop this in a system and see how these light up on the top portion over here. But let's see what this is. There's a compartment down here. Let's pop this open. Looks like we have a micro USB cable, another microfiber cloth. Kinda looks like a jewelry box. Oh, what? It just looks like empty dim slots for some reason. Am I supposed to, am I supposed to plug these in? Hold up, let me, let me try something. I think, I think I know what this is for actually. Let me plug this in real quick and pop these RAM sticks in here and uh, I'll be right back. All right guys, so I plugged in the USB to my laptop. Let's pop these bad boys in and see if it lights up. I mean, it has to, why else would there be a micro USB cable? Oh. I'm so scared of touching the surface. These are, these are so damn beautiful. Damn. I feel, like, I feel like if a rapper built a PC, like it would be using these kind of rap sticks. <laughs> Blinging up their, their rig. Like, I guess it's not lighting up. Um, I, I think I broke it. <laughs> I think I broke the RAM stick. <laughs> wow, that was easy. Um, well, I guess since we opened it up, let's take a closer look inside, shall we? we <laughs> 
I guess, you know what, my, my issue was, I guess I was supposed to push on both sides. I was pushing on only one side and kind of snapped off. So my fault, my fault. Um, and I don't know guys, this might be the engineering sample. So this might not be the actual retail sample. So um, yeah, just don't, don't, don't pay attention to any of this. So this crystal piece over here just sits on top. This is all plastic, by the way. Then you got the adhesive strip, kind of just squeezing everything together. Um, yeah, let's let's put this aside. Let's let's move on to the gold kit. All right, take two. Um, let's do the gold kit. I, I'm gonna be careful. This is the one I actually liked, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna try not to break this one. There we go. For a split second, I did see the ram sticks light up though. So let's, uh, let's pop this in. I'm so scared. How am I gonna slap this in? Uh, all right, let's Where is the, why is it lighting up? Oh, oh, that is so sweet. That looks legit. That looks legit. Wow, okay, let's, let's put on the other three actually. Let's see how it looks like. I'm so, I'm, I'm, I'm like so scared on snapping it in place. Maybe I just got a defective ram stick. Oh, these look so nice though, I'm not gonna lie. I would definitely use these in a build. Okay. What would you guys rather see these ram sticks in? Would you wanna see the gold sticks in an all gold slash black build? Or would you like to see the silver ram sticks in a black and silver build? Let me know in the comment section because I am down to use these in an upcoming build for sure. I did not break any ram sticks. Okay, we're good. We are good. But take a look at this, guys. Isn't that magnificent? This one isn't in all the way there. There we go. So it looks like Juice Kill sent this kind of display box to showcase how the RGB RAM sticks would light up in your PC. And I think right now it's only compatible with ASUS AutoSync, but you guys can download the software uh, from G Skills website. So if you're using a different motherboard like MSI, for example, you can download the software straight from the website and configure these. Uh, you can configure each stick individually or you can sync them all together, whichever you guys prefer, obviously, for your color scheme. But yeah, that's pretty much it. What do you guys think about these? Um, do you think it's too much bling or do you think it's just the right amount? Let me know in the comment section. All, as well as what build I should, or what color scheme I should be using these in. Um, yeah, I mean, they look pretty dope. One thing I did notice is that the crystallized plastic on the top here helps kind of scatter the lighting so there isn't any hot spots when I, like I usually see on other RAM sticks. So that actually works out. It's evenly spread across the top here. I was just thinking, what if I do like a gold and silver build, like alternate the RAM sticks, do like gold, silver, gold, silver, and then throughout the case, you would see like gold and silver parts from the cables to other parts of the PC. I think that will look, I think it'll be even more unique than just doing two alternate colors. But yeah, guys, that pretty much wraps up this quick unboxing and look at the uh, G-Skill Trident Z Royale RGB RAM sticks. Damn, that's a lot of words to say. Um, I just really hope the final product isn't as flimsy or fragile because I, I don't think I even applied that much pressure. Here, uh, replay the clip again real quick. I, don't know, I just feel like the adhesive strip maybe wasn't applied on the right way or it's not strong enough. That's the only thing I can think of why it popped out. But anywho's, I'm pretty much done here. I'll drop a link below if you guys wanna check these babies out. Uh, expect it in an upcoming build, of course. Uh, that's pretty much it. I love your faces. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next video.